Nashville, Tennessee, is called Music City, a place where aspiring musicians try to outshine the neon. But the road to Nashville wasn't a smooth one for Johnny Mills. He was a young child living in Erie, Pennsylvania, when his father died from a heart attack. Soon after, his mother would abandon Johnny, his brother, and five sisters. The state of Pennsylvania came in and, and took us, and my brother and I were fortunate enough to be able to go to Milton Hershey. The sisters were uh, taken to separate foster homes. Johnny came to Milton Hershey School with his older brother. They would live in student home Emerson. You know, I enjoyed making the kids feel like this was home to them. Yeah, I remember her singing a lot. And uh, it's really one of my first memories of music. And music would resonate with him. Johnny joined the Glee Club and hoped to be a trumpet player in the school's brown and gold band. But Bill Grove and Purnell Payne, who wrote the music to Milton Hershey's school's alma mater, encouraged him to play the drums instead. He graduated from Milton Hershey School in 1975. Johnny would travel from city to city to pursue his musical career. His big break came when he was invited to audition for legendary country star Jerry Reed. He got the job and moved to Nashville to tour with Reed for 12 years. And you know how they go around and they, um, they say, oh, on the guitar, this guy, and, uh, well, on the drums, I would make sure that when they introduced me, that it would be, and on the drums, uh, from Milton Hershey School, Hershey, Pennsylvania, Johnny Mills. He is quick to share his knowledge and skills, volunteering his time with future sound engineers in Nashville. He credits Milton Hershey with teaching him the value of giving back, which Johnny does through numerous charities like Habitat for Humanity, Mending Limbs, the Juvenile Diabetes Association, and Achilles International. I always love this picture. This right here. Memories made and opportunities given by the home and school that shaped him. The pictures of the alumnus of the year were along the wall, and we used to walk along that wall, and I would, I would look up at that wall all the time, and I'd think, you know, hopefully one of these days, wouldn't it be cool to have my picture up there? It's just an incredible honor to think that the people, the family that you grew up with, uh, thinks that you're worthy enough to have that honor. To me, it'd be better than winning a Grammy.